Well, how exciting is this? I get to do Science Sunday this weekend, and I'm joined by Aoife from the Connecticut Science Center. Nice to see you. Good morning. Thanks for jumping and doing some science with me. I am so excited, especially <laughs> since we're going to be doing this broom challenge thing, which yeah. we talked about during the week. Yeah. It kind of sounds a little hokey to me. I don't know. It sounds like it would work every day of the week, but what do I know? No, you're, you're absolutely right. Yeah, it kind of swept uh, social media a little bit. I get it. <laughs> swept social media. Uh -huh. <laughs> Um, so they were saying that on the 10th of February is the only day of the year that you can balance a broom because of the gravitational pull of the Earth is very unique on that day. And, okay. And like you said, it's, it's, it is kind of a hoax. It's a bit of a trick. Okay. <laughs> so we can make it happen. Yeah. So um, I have a broom out here that I have balanced, and today is not the 10th. Right? Today is not the 10th. Today is not the 10th, but uh, my broom is balancing. I, I have another one here that I can try to balance that it's a little bit older, right? a little bit splayed out. and. Yeah, good I mean, luck you, trying to get that to balance. She, she might guess that one's not going to balance very well. Can you balance the? Yeah, can you balance that one again yeah, so we this can just one. prove that there's no glue on there or anything? Yeah. Look at that. Exactly. Oh, absolutely perfect. <laughs> My new career. <laughs> um, you're, you're a broom handler. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, this one has those nice um, flat, even bristles on the end. So it's really just basic physics. It works kind of like a tripod. Okay. Think about it that way. Um, when you have enough of those bristles uh, evenly distributed, it will just hold the broom up. Isn't it's, it's so? It's a simple theory. It's a really simple theory, but I think what's going on is people don't ever think to balance brooms on any other day. I've never ever thought about balancing a broom until this challenge came out. Right, right. I have thought about balancing an egg. You have, yeah. What yes. day of the year do you know? The vernal equinox, yes. and uh, you know, is spring and fall, exactly. like those two times of the year, the equinoxes. Yeah. They, so they say, but I'm like, I don't think that's true too. I think you can balance an egg any other day of the week. Yeah, you got it. Exactly. You so, totally can. Oh, look, and there's one, for instance. We got an egg balancing here, but you're right. They say on the on the equinoxes, you can, it's the only day of the year that you can balance an egg. It's, you know, we're bringing in spring, but uh, we got one balancing here. There's a trick if you want to try it at home. Okay. So, yeah, I'd love to. Because it is tough, but if you take a little bit of salt and you make a little mound of salt, okay. and then we can take our egg, and that salt just gives it a little bit of support, and it helps hold our egg up. Oh, let me try a different egg. See, some all eggs are not created exactly. equally here. So we're 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 doing it. And then once we get it balanced, look at that. All you can do then is just blow away some of that salt. Softly. Softly, yep. And you're gonna leave the um, the grains of salt that are helping hold that egg up, but it it kind of makes it look like there's nothing underneath there, and you're balancing that egg on its own. But you can balance an egg on its own even without the salt. Yes, yeah. Try a couple different eggs, though, because like you said, they're all different. Because all eggs, again, are not created equal. And that's, uh, that's no yolk. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, thank you, Aoife. We appreciate you being here. You got... We got what's going on at the Science Center. Yeah, so um, this weekend is President's Day weekend. We're open today and tomorrow. Um, we have Casey Carl's Bubble Show. If you want to jump online and grab tickets to that, we also have our Winter Carnival going on, which is included with general admission. So today and tomorrow is a great day to come visit the Science All Center. All right, thank you, Eva. We appreciate it. And that's another edition of Science Sunday. <laughs>